Hello and welcome to Learning Science. In this video, I will discuss one of the powerful feature of Power BI called Personalized Visual. This allows end user or report reader in the Power BI service to change visual depending on user choice. Let us jump to the computer for the demo. So here you can see my Power BI report open in Power BI desktop. To enable a personalized visual option, I have to go to file. Option and setting in option and setting option. In option you have to scroll down and you have to select report setting. Once you will select report setting, you have to little bit scroll down and you will find here option personalized visual. So if this option is not enabled on your Power BI desktop, you have to enable this option and click OK. Once you enable this option, you will notice once you will select any visual, you will notice here a small icon personalized visual. So it will appear all, for all the visuals. OK. So now what we have to do, you, you have to save this report and publish this report on Power BI service. So now my report is publishing on the Power BI service. Once it is published on the Power BI service, you have to open this report in Power BI service. So let me open it. So this is report is open in Power BI service. Take the, this visual. So total says by year and you can see the line chart, but I want to see in column chart. So again, I will click here on personalize this visual. And here you can see the visualization type X axis. Y axis. Secondary axis legend small multiples. If you do not know about small multiples, please watch our video. You will find the link in the description box of this video. The tool tips. So let me change a visualization type and I will select from here. Once I will click, you will see all the options and from here I will select column chart. So now this visual is converted into a column chart. So any any point of time, if you want to reset this visual, you just you have to click here reset this visual. So it will come to original. Position. OK, now for this visual, I will add a legend. So again, let me click on personalized visual and from here I will select a stack column chart. So this one. Now my category will be as it is. My total cells will be as it is. Let me add a legend from here. Now it is showing me all my data table. So my data table is the training sample too. And from here I will select region. OK, now you will see. The region is added, so now this this visual is category wise and the region wise. So even in the donor chart, if you want to change it, you can change and you can select a, like, you know, funnel chart. Let me select funnel chart. So this is my funnel chart. As I told you, any point of time you can reset this. OK. That's all for this video. I request you to please subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.